I believe that in 10 years' time, if we are to meet back in Bahrain and all the startups that pitch there, I won't be surprised that the France idea that was third or fourth will now be number one mm -hmm. because the systems in terms of the commercial arrangement, the banking system, all you need to do is to put a viable business plan there. You are going to borrow at almost a negative rate, almost 1% or 1.5% maximum. But I know that you are going to face challenges because you have to borrow at a commercial rate. First of all, nobody wants to listen to you as a startup. Mm -hmm. So these are the genuine <coughs> difficulties that a Ghanaian or an African entrepreneur have to face. Mm -hmm. It is not an easy path. But the point is that those who prevail, those who still insist that they have a vision and a passion and that they are not looking for money, because if your passion is to look for money, then at a point you give up. But if your passion is to make sure a certain dream is fulfilled and a certain vision is pursued, no matter the difficulties, you still strive until there's a way. Mm. Because the system has proved that indeed there can be a way. Right. And I always use those who have made it in Ghana, the Kwesitruns, the Despites, the Kesbins. If we check the educational background, in most cases, they didn't even have first degrees when they were pursuing their businesses. It is recently most of them have gone for degrees. But yet, the kind of businesses they have managed to set up in this country just by pursuing business, they are now recruiting top-class graduates and double certificate holders to work for them. So all that we are saying is, let's build a consciousness among young people, not every one of them. But at least if we can get one third of the youth who are looking for a job to say, we are prepared to now go on that path and government will assist you. Government will assist, but look, even government support, there's an extent to which government support can help anybody. If you don't have the self-drive mm. and also the private sector doesn't come on board in terms of our loans, structuring and the banking arrangements. And as for the laws and policy, I can tell you that we are continuously reviewing. Mm. We don't have the best of environment at the moment, but the feedback and the direction of government is gradually helping to improve so that we can have the best. And some of these engagements, we pick the feedback, we will all share ideas and whatever we need to do, even if it means making laws in parliament or advising government to tow a certain policy direction. You remember two, three years ago, government have to reduce benchmark values by 50%. It was because of the feedback that import duties were high and government did it. So if we get the feedback, that this is what we can do to improve startups and businesses in our country. I can assure you, we are prepared as a government to listen, to work with young people, those with the passion and vision to create their jobs, and then we'll succeed.